the cells don't think. Each each one of the cells cannot think, right? But together they collaborate to you know to give me the ability to to think or to you know to 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 lift this mouse or, or to do things that each cells cannot do themselves. Mm, Does that make sense? And that then touches on power influence. Your clout in an organization. Can you you know you can have great discussions, and if you can't make anything happen or can't get a new idea started, then you know, people pretty quickly say, well, what the, what's the point of collaborating? The beast demands that you make five comments and, and get five page views, and, and the manager will ensure that you do that. And how, how can that possibly be tied to any successful business outcome? I don't. You know, with our mentality, which I agree with our mentality of creating that enthusiasm and energy and synergies and all of that stuff and getting people to be excited about your products, uh, the same way that they're becoming your brand advocates, they can become the next day the brand advocates of your competitor. Uh, what are you going to do next? Mm -hmm. Are you going to just let it go like that or are you going to go and engage back and see how you can regain back that trust? So this, I think there are some actually some quite simple strategic questions that uh, need to be asked. And one of, one of those is where do we collaborate and where do we compete? One of the things, one of the research uh, efforts we're about to launch is um, if, you, uh, if you really took talent development, learning as your, as your highest priority as a company, and recognize that the most valuable learning is um, not in training programs, uh, which are actually less and less effective, but in the day-to-day -day work that the, the workers do on the job. Um, how would you redesign the workplace to accelerate learning, to accelerate talent development? I have a question. Uh, yes. How uh, did you uh, come across my uh, research? I can get the S S A A S from there, mm -hmm. which is you know software as a service, a pure software as a service, just a functionality. It should, could just be a web service <laughs> that does this little thing to produce this business output for me. But I don't get the data there. You know, this web series or this SAAS uh, just says, you know, we need to work on this data. Where do I find the data? So if I ask a friend a question, we can get to some of the unstructured data inside people's heads and hopefully get to a, a better network. You're only as good as your network, right? We're going from one era to another. The idea, you know, once upon a time, and in a lot of businesses, this is still true. They have a tremendous amount of stuff stuck in documents, right? So you will edit this, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>